Yud is good, yo. It's your boy Ty back here with another video. And in this video today, we're going to be doing a gameplay of the new Pink Diamond, Michael Porter Jr. Now, Michael Porter Jr. in general, guys, in 2K's history has just been a hype beast name. It's just that simple. People have loved MPJ, first of all, because he's 6'10". Second of all, because he has had historically a pretty solid release. Now, how good do I think MPJ is? That's what we're going to be talking about. 6'10", 218 pounds, 93 three ball, 85 driving deck, 86 point. Defensively, I just think he's mediocre. 85 block, 88 steel, 89 perimeter, 85 interior, 91 speed, 90 lateral quickness. Tendency wise for MPJ, pretty solid across the board. Does have 15 out fingers, catch, shoot, corner specialist, clamps, intimidator, blinder, circus threes, limitless chef. Hit us today's quick first step, dead eye sniper. So some pretty good Hall of Famers, 48 gold badges to make it. So he has 63 base badges. I just got MPJ for 25,000 MT. Now initially when these cards first came out, I was like, people are just gonna gas MPJ and just overspend on him. Now for 25,000 MT, I'm pretty optimistic that MPJ is going to be pretty decent for that price. Now, looking at MPJ here in Shootout, I will say I do like the fact that his player model is large, right? He looks pretty tall on the court. Hot spots forever outside of the right slot, which is where I was shooting my first shot from. Release-wise, I mean, it's okay, guys. I don't want to sit here and gas it, its release. After using Kevin Love, his release feels just pretty mid. I mean, Kevin Love's release is obviously way better. He just reminds me of a Jeremy Grant that we've already seen, but obviously MPJ is a little taller. Jeremy Grant's stats are way better. That's what we covered in our preview video of all the cards. I just don't know if this release under pressure is one of the top releases in the game. I've never really loved Jump Shot 62 though. So I mean, I will be lying to say like, I am not just in general biased against it. Uh, check it out, does have the normal leaner, which Honestly, this normal leaner with Hall of Fame Circus 3s is where MPJ is going to have to be great. Because I don't see enough outside of this to really love MPJ. Now, again, that might be biased and that might be my, you know, biased opinion. But it is what it is. I just don't think I see enough MPJ outside of this to really be that high on the card. Now, let's check out his full court dribbles, his dunk package, stuff like that. To see something okay, decent on the back, not great, decent tween. I like that dunk. Looking at Michael Porter Jr. here on current gen, player model does look good. I mean, on bullet gens, it's the one thing I will say is MPJ looks closer to 6'11 than, than 6'10. I mean, he just does. He has such a long player model, such a, I mean, decent player model that I feel like that is what might keep him on the court. I mean, people are running Thon Maker, and Thon Maker's stats are, aren't great. I mean, obviously, he's better than, uh, better than MPJ, probably. But people are running him because of his player model. And because he just makes plays on the court. So if MPJ can do that to a high degree for 25K, I'll hype up the card. But he's got a lot of showing me to do in this game. But we're going to use Michael Porter Jr. here in a My Team Unlimited game. I mentioned Thon Maker, but I did not mean mention Jonathan Isaac. So our big thing is, is Michael Jordan even in the same stratosphere as those guys? Because obviously we all know I like those guys in general. So it's just going to be an interesting little debate here. MJ, chill. Just switching everything or what? Shot. Bring a shot, MJ. One of those things, uh, that's a good start to the game. My opponent trying to do anything to not let you get involved, but you're still just going to have to find a way. Come here, man. Mash him out. Okay, good play, MPJ. Spawn free. Okay, MP. That's green, too. We know, yo, early. We know what Kevin Love gets into. Yo, get a fresh defensive player on him. Horrible. And it's K Love's rebound. I love Kevin Love. Leaner Thank Green. You, MPJ. That's what I need you to do. He stayed with that. I guess. Yo, leave him open, please. Leave MPJ open, please. We about got that one though, didn't we, MPJ? Uh oh. Leaner Green. Tough one. 
That's a tough one for you, MPJ, but with the Hall of Fame Circus 3s, I'm going to be willing to let some of those go, man. Yup. You got nowhere to go. He boxed. You got nowhere to go. It's a box possession because his MJ is boxed. Please, MPJ, you just got thrown out the way. What did I just witness? Yes, should be my free. That's a dot. Oh my gosh, dude. I need an MPJ. Nope. Everybody knows I need it. Come on, 2K. Bro, switches everything. I don't care, I'm mashing. I don't care how it looks. I'm mashing you at this point. I got to show off with MPJ somehow. Literally suck, bro. Y'all literally... Thank you. Good board, MPJ. Come on. Dot. Dot. Come on. Stop playing with MPJ, man. He got 11, 4, and 2. I mean, he playing fine. And I'm not even playing well. That's my thing. Is It's like... I'm not even playing well. I'm not even trying to play well, bro. I'm just trying to get MPJ involved. And you're still going to lose. Come on, man. Yo. Six seconds. Dot. Who? Who are you dotting? Who are you dotting? You are boxed. Yup. Boxed. MPJ's D right there. And that's one of those things, man. He sat on MPJ. And I still was decently efficient with the card. Here's the deal, guys. Ultimately, Michael Porter Jr. is a card. I don't want to say this, but I'm going to say it. He's worse than, and then Don, he's worse than Jonathan Isaac. With that being said, right now, at the current time, right, again, it's probably going to go up, maybe go down, I don't know. Right now, at this current time, this current moment, Michael Porter Jr. is cheap. And I don't expect him to ever be over 30K. Now, 25K for MPJ is not a bad budget. My thing is this, he's way cheaper than Don Maker. And when you compare him even to a guy like Jonathan Isaac right now, Look, guys, he's cheaper than Jonathan Isaac. So, as far as cheap small forwards, he's up there with being one of the best in the game. That's all you can really ask for. I really do like what 2K is doing with content in general. Making all these cards very usable and very cheap in my team. And just gives you options to have fun with multiple different cards. So, will MPJ ever make a no money spent squad appearance? Possibly. And so might Kevin Love. Is MPJ even better than Kawhi? I don't think so. Let's get to wrap it up for the video though today, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. And as always, man, I love you guys. Have a blessed day.